Hey, and welcome to the guide shop. I wanted to share with you what I was using to catch those crappy with the other day when we did the video. First of all, the bodies I was using were Charlie Brewer slider crappy grubs. Uh, you can get them in the tournament pack, which these are a hundred pack, uh, or you can get them in the small pack. I think there's uh Mm, that's probably about 20 in this pack, 18, 20, I guess. The colors I was using is the Junebug Chartreuse, white, and smoke glitter. Just rotating those around depending on the sun. If it was cloudy or in the morning, I kind of like the darker colors as the sun came up, smoke glitter. And then just every once in a while, I trade up and start using the white just to give them a different look. The heads I was using, uh, the first head was a quick set. It's a quick set weedless crappy jig. It's got a little weed guard. Where, where I was fishing, it's a lot of wood. Uh, you could get by probably with using just a regular head. And it, as long as you had... 10 pound braid you can you can pull the bend the hook and bend it back they've got those gold aberdeen hooks on them so that's good for for bending out and putting back uh, i was using the eighth ounce just because the water was eight to twelve foot uh, so this get the eighth gets down a little bit better than the sixteenth uh, the other head i was using was the eighth ounce slider crappy head now i'll show you each one of them here is the uh quick set head it's got a little weed guard on it you can bend it adjust it move it around it stays on pretty good and the other head is the charlie brewer crappy slider head and this was this was the one I would use if it was a a lot of wood down there. Uh, once you rig it up, that's what it looks like. I put this one on the white. Uh, always rig it so your paddle tail runs that way when when you're pulling it through the water. And this is what the crappy head looks like rigged up. So that was what I was using. Uh, like I said, my, my baits, my bites were coming eight to 12 foot of water. Uh, just depending, uh, I was looking for schools of fish with the forward facing sonar. Uh, I really wasn't keyed in on any structure or anything like that. I was just looking for the schools of fish. Sometimes they, they would be around some wood uh, other times they'd be out in the wide open. So, you know, you just had to look around for them. But that's what I was using. I'll leave a list of everything in the comments. And uh, if you have any questions, want to, want to know any more information, uh, just let me know. All right. See you all next time.